We are at Rutgers University, and this is the rapid prototyping uh, lab. I'm doing uh, research on 3D printing. So I thought about how to help the community and the society with the technology that I'm, I'm um, working on. Currently, we are making a 3D printed tactile map. People who lost their vision, the blind and the visually impaired, because they don't have vision, they cannot use the map that we typically use. So what you do is basically draw the model of these maps on the computer, um, save it as the appropriate file, and just feed it to the printer and it prints out. This is a uh, tactile map, and it's essentially uh, a floor plan. We have a uh, braille legend and some other dedicated symbols to represent the rooms and bathrooms of the, of the floor. Being able to print any structure or three-dimensional object you can print can help the visually impaired because they rely on mostly the three-dimensional objects they can feel and touch. Okay, so that's the beauty of the 3D printing. It's great to have access to these sorts of technologies. This is the first time I actually got to see um, a project, I guess, through to the end. It was something um, that I could not only say was kind of cool to make, but also is you know, sort of good for the community. As an educator, we eventually we want to do something good for the society with the technology that we are developing here. But uh, I don't believe we have to wait until we come up with a super uh, a cool technology. Uh, basically, we have already ability to help the society with what we have already.